think through this uh, console that's in here. Oh wait, maybe I'm supposed to just use this pipe on a bunch of stuff. And the bed. The console. I know I'm supposed to use the pipe on something. Please proceed to your scheduled appointments. What are my scheduled appointments? Kick it? Scheduled appointments. There's these grates everywhere. What if I kick one? Kicking it won't force it off. Anybody in there? Nothing. So names. I'll try to Giselle. Giselle? What do you want, Charlie? Aha. Did you tell, Did you me, tell to me to escape? Shut up! Don't talk. Get uh -huh. in or don't. Well, don't walk in the room, or the camera will see you. I don't think they have any hearing receptors in here. I've checked before. Okay. So, Charlie, how is it that you can remember now? Epsilon 5 told me. Don't be mad. If I kept everyone who made an escape for me after they had their memories wiped again, there would be way too many people to bust out of here. I don't hate you. It's just easier to escape with less people. Okay. I don't like being used. You were going to use me. You knew what you were getting into. That's why you had Epsilon 5 remind you. It's nothing personal, Charlie. So why do you want to escape? Don't you trust them? Why try to escape? Don't you know what this place is? It's a rehab center for criminals. That means they wipe your brain when you get in, and they wipe your brain when you go out. I don't know about you, but I'm not ready to lose my identity again after already losing it once. This consciousness is the only one I have. And I'm not going to let some other person decide who I am, what I've done, and what I act like. Even if I live again out of this place, it's the same as being dead to me if I don't know about it. That's why I need to escape. That's why I need to get out of here and find my old memory, who I really am. And that's why you agreed to help me, because you saw the same thing. Having your memory wiped and being turned into a new person is the same as dying again. Okay. She's very, um, forceful about this. Yeah, I... I got my memory wipe just to help you, I mean. And now you're going on about all this stuff? That 
that's like saying, yeah, you did stuff, but, uh, fuck you. But I had my memory wiped to help you. But you're still the same person as before. You still have the same people to remind you. After you leave this place, we'll never see each other again. You won't be aware of your other consciousness. The way I see it is, even though we existed before and will exist in the future, it doesn't matter because we only have this consciousness, who we are right now, and I want to keep it that way. A thought just came to my mind. The guy who was standing in the window in that room down there is the guy who left me the note. That's probably the doctor who wanted to help me out of the place. Funny the things that come to mind when you stop listening. Uh, bu -bu 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 you were just going to take my map. You were just going to take my map and leave me in the dark. Well, I guess you were smarter than that, since somehow you're here right now. Yes, I am quite intelligent. Or so Epsilon 5 has led me to believe. That's why you want to escape? You don't want them to rehabilitate you? If I don't escape, I know they'll wipe my memory again when I'm done with the testing. That's why I can't pass my final exam. If I do, they'll send me straight out of here and I won't have this consciousness ever again. But you don't remember who you were before. It doesn't matter. If I really need to know, they should have my old identity on their memory banks somewhere. If you want yours, we can swing by. But then you'll probably lose this memory in the process. So who cares? Am I right? Huh. I don't know, maybe... If it overwrites everything, you'd lose it, but... I don't know. It's a tricky concept. When are you escaping? Why should I tell you? You're not in. in unless you're a useful asset, and right now, you're not a useful asset. But I can use a gun. That's useful. But I helped plot the map. And now I don't need you anymore, so get lost. Oh, screw you, bitch. Who else is going with you? I'm not gonna tell you. Yes, you will. I want in. I said useful asset. What can I do to help? I don't know. What can you do? What? What are they training you in now? Guns. 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 Now that actually might be a useful commodity. Tell you what, if you can get me a gun, you can be part of the escape. All right. It's not that easy, though. You'll have to sneak it out of the testing room. God knows how. They have sensors to detect if you've moved anything out of the testing chamber. I'll get it out. I don't think you get how hard this is going to be, but okay. Don't come back here until you get it. Close the door on your way out. Hmm. All right. Can you move that? Got it. Okay, move that shelf. And definitely the only thing behind each one is the grating. Right. That's fair enough. Let's get... Um, I'll try a two pound weight. And see if that will allow me to get the gun out. Skip through, get out, skip over, get in. Ask the guys for help. 
scan me. Scanning for unauthorized testing apparatus. Scan complete. Okie dokie. Oh, it's you again. I'll send up the gun if you want to practice. Thank you. What do we got in here? We've got a grate. Let's go look at it. The grate leads into a drain. What can I do with it? Screwed in place. So basically I need to go back to maintenance now. there, but the only reason we have to move stuff around in the gym is if it ends up at one of those grades. Do you know anything about an escape plan? Um, not really. Did Giselle tell you about it? Not much. What do you know about Giselle? You said she was trying. Maybe you should find her. Okay, so you don't help much. Goodbye. Bye. Right. I don't think Balder will help much. And I don't really want to discuss an escape plan with him. But I may have to. Chances of Giselle keeping him in the loop probably slim to none. So it's a very risky thing indeed trying to talk to him. So many people we can discuss all this with. Hey, Charlie. How's it going? Do you know anything about an escape plan? Eh, uh, should I? Really, I, I have no idea what you're talking about. Bye. See you around. And there's proof. We can't trust him. Do what to do, what to do, what to do. At this point, all we can do is go down to maintenance again. I mean, that pipe has to be combined with the weight. That's what I'm getting. Unless you have a gun with you, I'm not letting you back in. I need to go in there to get the gun. Fine. Hey there, Charlie. Since you're here, I thought maybe you could help me with something. Uh -huh. Give me What's that? I was trying to finish my maintenance shift when I realized I needed to reset the air shafts from level 2 to here. You want me to fix it? Well, if you insist. Yes, if I you do. want to try, you can use this machine down here. What about the camera? You really think somebody's watching us? If you're really that paranoid, fine. Stay up there. I don't care. Okay. Well, first off, Giselle, I want to talk with you. What do you know about this place? What do you know about this place? It's as plain as day to me. This is what you'd call a rehabilitation center. 
It's where they transform criminals or lowlifes back into law-abiding citizens. Unethical? Sure, but I'm sure they don't care. Or, as I expect, law-abiding citizens get turned into the uh, Boreal Kuden militia, or whatever kind of... About the escape. Get me the gun, and then we'll talk. force they're using. How do I get the gun out of the testing chamber? Who knows? The door won't even open unless you put the gun back. And even if you get the gun out somehow, they'll detect it in the next room. I heard they had to install those sensors because one day someone got a gun out and went on a rampage. Killed like three people. I wonder was it me? Can you help me with something? No. How do I work this machine again? You need a vent path from number three to number ten to clear the airway. That means you need to turn on vents to green to connect them. But you can only turn on five at a time. Otherwise, the power will go out. Okay. What do you know about the director? The director? What about the guy? If there was ever a person responsible for our fate, he's the one. So he should be held responsible. Meaning? Kill him. What do you know about Epsilon 5? Oh yeah, I forgot you had your memory wiped again. She was a scrawny little kid who got picked on until you stood up for her. The Greenies used to steal her food tickets all the time. For some reason, she refuses to pick a name for herself. Maybe she wants her own real name. Don't tell me of this evil Balder. What do you know about Balder? Oh, so you don't remember then? It's nothing really. He just doesn't get along with the others. So he did something to me. What about you, lady? Tell me about yourself. No thanks, kid. Ah, fuck you. Right, let's use your machine. I'm trying to reset the vent. To do this, you'll need to clear out the entire stretch of piping from here to the second level. Okay. But how will we do that? This stretch would effectively be shaft number three to shaft number ten. The power influx is low right now, so you can only open up to five shafts at a time once you reactivate the ventilation system. When you turn on shafts, they turn green, and also turn on any adjacent shafts. Okay. So, there's only enough power to activate five shafts right now to clear the system from shaft number three to shaft number ten, so choose wisely. Have fun.
that one on with the, this one on. So there we go. Now how do we get that one to turn on? There we go. One, two, three, four, five. Perfect. So you fixed it. Nice job. Now, any foreign objects in the ventilation system on level 2 will get sent down here, in case it gets stuck again. Excellent. Uh, right, we will first move that box here. 